Hilda von Droste. I've heard the stories. Everyone has. We know what you did at the breach. It's odd for a Dalish elf to care what happens to anyone else, but you'll get no backtalk here. That's a promise. Inquisition Scout Harding, at your service. I, well, all of us here, will do whatever we can to help. <laughs> Harding, huh? Ever been to Kirkwall's High Town? I can't say I have. Why? You'd be Harding and. No, <laughs> never mind. <laughs> that was awful. That was awful, but so good, Varric. I want to hear more about this. Wait, never mind. Uh, listen, it's very nice to meet you. Uh, Harold of Andraste, reporting in for duty. It's a pleasure to make your acquaintance. We should get to business. The situation's pretty dire. Oh, good. We came to secure horses from Redcliffe's old horse master. I grew up here, and people always said that Dennett's herds were the strongest and the fastest this side of the Frostbacks. But with the Mage Templar fighting getting worse, we couldn't get to Dennett. Maker only knows if he's even still alive. Mother Giselle's at the crossroads helping refugees and the wounded. Our latest reports say that the war's spread there, too. Corporal Vale and our men are doing what they can to help protect the people, but they won't be able to hold out very long. Okay. You best get going. No time to lose. Thank you. Did anybody get directions for where we need to go to meet this, uh, was it Corporal Vale and everybody? Well, this area sure looks like it's seen better days. The poor people that live here. That's not fair. Down here, though, right? I see a rift off in the distance. How many rifts are there? Like, am I supposed to just find them randomly and close them? See, now this is just plain old stupid, right? Like, 100% plain old stupid. Why are they fighting like this? And then just... It doesn't solve anything if all you do is just sit there and fight each other and end up killing each other. But I guess they don't even want to try to have a conversation about forces. it. They're trying to protect the refugees. All right, let's help. Looks like they could use a hand. Good news. We're here to help. You! Oh. Goodbye. We are not apostates. I do not think they care, Seeker. Yeah, Cassandra, I don't think anybody really wants to chit-chat with us. I think everybody's just got a real big bad case of I'm angry. I mean, two can play at that game. We are not Templars. We mean you no harm. They don't care. Doesn't look like they're listening. Nobody's listening. That's the problem. Hey, they got in the back. Careful, everybody. Not even a challenge. You guys say that now, and then they are a challenge. And then everybody gets hurt. What do we got? Oh, there was another back there. Careful. Is he, is that? Hold on. I think I got him this way. All right, he's gone. Unfortunately. Any more? Be ready. More coming our way. Yay. Right here? Yep, I see him. All right, I got that one. One down! How's everybody else doing? Oh, he just kind of snuck up on me out of nowhere. Oh, Archer. I'm going to take care of the Archer because, I mean, that's got to hurt. No offense, Varric. Okay. Cassandra behind you. Never mind. I got rid of that. And then, I think, Solus, you got that? Is there anybody else? No. Okay, nobody's over there. Hey, Solus, maybe don't play with the Templar. Just a thought. Maybe we don't play with him. No? Okay. Just curious if you thought that that was a good idea or not. It's done. All right. I think that's everybody.
There are mages here who can heal your wounds. Lie still. Don't... Don't touch me, Mother. Their magic is... Turn to noble purpose. Their magic is surely no more evil than your blade. What? Hush, dear boy. Allow them to ease your suffering. Mother Giselle. I am. And you must be the one they are calling the Herald of Andraste. Yep. That is, uh, that is me. You're not against magic? Sincerely? What you said to that soldier. We do not teach that magic is evil. We teach that pride is evil and does not corrupt only mages. But I did not ask you to come simply to debate with me. Then why am I here? I know of the Chantry's denouncement, and I am familiar with those behind it. I won't lie to you. Some of them are grandstanding, hoping to increase their chances of becoming the new divine. That doesn't surprise me. Some are simply terrified. That too doesn't so many surprise good me. People senselessly taken from us. It was a tragedy. 100%. I am sorry for any losses that you suffered during it. What happened was horrible. Fear makes us desperate, but hopefully not beyond reason. Go to them. Convince the remaining clerics you are no demon to be feared. They have heard only frightful tales of you. Give them something else to believe. I'm sorry, did you just say you want me to go visit them? As in, you want me to go to wherever they are, introduce myself, and tell them that I promise you I'm not the big, bad, scary elf that you think I am? Will that work? I mean, if it will, I'll give it a try. That won't just make it worse. Because you are a mage. That too. Let me put it this way. Yeah? You needn't convince them all. You just need some of them to doubt. Oh, that's fair. Their power is their unified voice. Take that from them and you receive the time you need. Oh, no, I mean, honestly, that does make a lot of sense. Thank you for the help. I appreciate it. It's good of you to do this. I honestly don't know if you've been touched by fate or sent to help us, but I hope. Hope is what we need now. The people will listen to your rallying call, as they will listen to no other. You could build the Inquisition into a force that will deliver us, or destroy us. I will go to Haven, and provide Sister Leliana the names of those in the Chantry, who will be amenable to a gathering. Thank you. It is not much, but I will do whatever I can. No, it's a great help. Corporal Vale is coordinating the Inquisition's efforts in the area. We okay. should speak with him. Yeah, absolutely. We'll go say hi, see if there's anything we can do to help. Also, just kind of wander around and of see course. if there's anything anybody needs. So you said Corporal Vale was up this way. It was really nice that one of the uh, merchants over there ended up having the daggers that I needed. What luck. But... Yes, sir. Who is this Corporal Vale? Do we know anything about him, or am I just supposed to play nice? Oh, we're training. Right. Okay. That looks like fun. Corporal Vale, is it? You're with the Inquisition? Yes. Corporal Vale. Nice to meet thanks you. Thanks for your help. The Majors and Templars don't seem to care who gets caught in their war. The refugees here are in dire need of help. If the war doesn't kill them, cold or starvation will. That doesn't sound good at all. Can I ask you a quick question? You said that the Templars and the Mages are causing trouble. Can you tell me a bit about the Templars? What can you tell me about the Templars? All the Templars were called to Val Royo not long ago. Okay. These bastards ignored the order. Ah. Now they're killing rebel mages, along with any refugees they think are mage sympathizers. Every Templar I've ever known has wanted to protect the common folk. These men defile their order's good name. And then, what about the mages on top of it all? Because I know you said both. What can you tell me about the rebel mages? The real rebels are up north in Redcliffe, dug in and taking care of their own. Oh, good. The ones out here are just apostates, locked up in the circles all these years, and now they've gone mad with power. 
The rebels in Redcliffe have washed their hands of them. I wish we could do the same. Yeah, well, hopefully somebody will be able to wash everybody's hands of them at some point. You said people might starve? You were concerned about refugees starving. Yes. Yeah? Many of them brought food. Okay. But they expected to be home by now. Or safe in a city. Fair. There's a hunter up the hill who had some ideas. And then you also mentioned that people are cold. Is there anybody working on that? Is there anything we can do to help people deal with the cold? I asked the Inquisition to send blankets. You'd think I was asking for a wagon of raw Lyrian. A recruit named Whittle is trying to make what we can bring in last. If you have any ideas, talk to him across the road. All right, I will definitely go and talk to him. Are there any other concerns that we should be made aware of before I get going? What other problems do these refugees face? We've got some injuries that go beyond stitches and elf fruit. I know healers are in short supply, but if you can find someone in Redcliffe to help us, it would save a lot of lives. Absolutely. If and when I make my way to Redcliffe, I will see if I can find us an extra healer or two and send them down this way. Do you know anything about the horse master I'm looking for? What can you tell me about the man who's supposed to be getting horses for the Inquisition? Horse master Dennett? Yeah. He lives on a farm to the west. Tough old fella. Good. We haven't heard from him. Best we can tell, he's old up until the majors and Templars are done killing each other. Excellent. Hopefully he's still there. I gotta go talk to him. Thank you for your time. Farewell. And you as well. Perfect. So now we know what we're doing. Kind of. Right? We're gonna go talk to Dennett. We're gonna get them blankets and food. Not Dennett. I mean, if Dennett and needs a blanket, I can absolutely get him a blanket too, but... We got to get the refugees, blankets, food, You're all that other good stuff. Yes. And a healer. That definitely sounds like a high priority. If and whenever we get to Redcliffe. I don't even know how to get to Redcliffe. I literally know nothing of what's around here. Um, I'm guessing the recruit is over there with the rest of the Inquisition people. Because he said like across the road. But did he say the hunter is like in this area? Just what I heard. Uh, these are people um hey can i talk to you that's the last of the bread going to be a long hungry night are you the hunter that i should talk to about the food situation these people need food there are rams out in the hills good eating cooks easy and no lords around to kill you for poaching too dangerous to go hunting now more likely to find mages than mutton Oh, okay. Well, let me see what I can do to help. Good luck. Luck won't put fat on your ribs. No, no, it won't. However, me and my friends, we might be able to help with that. Is there anybody else over here that wants to talk? I don't yes, think sir. so. This is so interesting the way that they've all just Thank you. moved into the area, you know? I don't think I expected it quite so much. I'm walking into people's houses like it's nothing and there are people sleeping here i should leave i should good absolutely day. 100 hey, good baby. day 100 percent leave ivy you can't just walk into people's houses you. you gotta keep remembering that uh stairs down here let's go see if we can find ourselves a nice very wholesome recruit what Welcome did they back. say his name was whittle or something like that um oh good that whole wall is kind of sort of falling Thank apart you. One wrong move and it's all going to go... And there are mages and Templars running around. Fighting each other. For fun. I'll keep an eye Uh-oh. Thank you. Well, hopefully this holds. Hey, um, I'm looking for Recruit Whittle. More cold weather coming. Yeah? Fool villagers. Where are their coats? You must be the person that I'm looking for then. People are cold, I've heard, and we need supplies. Do you have ideas? What do you need to keep these refugees warm? Blankets, warm clothes, all of it. These poor sods lost everything when the mages and the Templars went crazy. If we were in a village, I could just pinch a blanket off a clothesline and be fine. Out here, I'm sure the apostates have plenty of supplies, just haven't been able to find them. Then I shall go find them for us. Thank you. Farewell. And see you. All right. Lots of stuff to do then. The never-ending to-do list. I don't know, I kind of like staying busy, so this to-do list is more than welcome. We'll see if we can help people, get people warm, get them some food, and 
They really are just out here fighting and causing chaos, huh? Look at this. I know. The apostates have gone mad with power. Oh my god. I see just as many Templars. Yup. Same. Oh man, it is so... I'm not even gonna lie. It is so nice to have my daggers back. No, you! Stop it! Templars. Where do they get these shields from? Oh, Cassandra, you all right? Is he gone yet? No. All right, that one. And I feel like there is no reasoning with them at this point. Like, can you reason with any of them? I doubt it. I sincerely, really and truly doubt it. This is just We utter... must continue on if we are to secure the Alliance. Okay. Right, secure the Alliance, all that stuff. Because, you know. Oh no, Cassandra, those are gonna hurt. Yeah. At least, at least it was exactly what I thought it was. Hold on. All right, good. Gone? Fantastic. Anything in their pockets? Just gold. I'll take whatever I can get. So we have all of this. More of them over here. Done it is straight through, right? And then there just seems like there's so much more. Blankets, food, all of it. Somebody's house. These guys really want to play? Really? Excuse you. Thank you. Cassandra, will you go get the mage? Or I guess, were they both technically mages? Thank you. So what? You're gonna come for me, aren't you? Enjoy. Are uh, you? Mage first. Are they like, is this guy a mage or is he like a mage bodyguard? Like, you notice some of the mages have like bodyguards following them around? It's kind of weird, right? Oh, is that elf fruit? <gasps> you can never have enough of this stuff. Oh, I love, wait, you too. What is going on? <laughs> Careful, that mage likes to set up glyphs. And if these glyphs are like the glyphs I trained with, they suck. No, that's cheating. Cheater, cheater. Nobody likes the cheater. Stop doing that. Can you, Ooh, behind me. Guys, tiny, 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 tiny me. All of them. This should be fun. Why are there so many of them? They just keep like, I don't even want to say multiplying. They keep like gazillion applying. Like you get rid of two of them and then like 12 more appear. See what I mean? Where did this guy come from? Can you take the lightning? Thank you. Is that Beautiful all of them? Area to have seen so much sadness. Yeah, so much sadness. Awful, awful, awful sadness. I am awfully sad for this area. <gasps> Is this spindleweed? Oh, I've needed some of this stuff for a bit. I can't be the only one that enjoys using spindleweed randomly. Uh, I guess forward for Dennett? I feel like we should secure the horses, right? <gasps> you are not with the Inquisition. Where did you come from? That's gonna hurt again. Yay. But um, he, we need, we should secure Dunnit first, right? Then after we secure Dunnit, we should 100% get food and supplies for everybody. I think that's my plan. Does everybody else like that plan? I'm kind of open to if people like or don't like my plan. Is that a note? We must be ready to fight not only the mages, but those who sympathize with them. Uh, have not the mages blood magic to trick the minds of the unwary? Are not most people as we know them sheep ready to be led by those who speak with authority? The people must be protected from the mages. It is our right and our duty. 
but those who supply them with lyrium, who, those who offer them comfort and food, those who shirk their duty to supply us for our worthy fight. They are sympathizers who have lain with the demons and can breed only abominations, and they must be slain as such. We will wage our war from our camp off the west road, and we will not stop until this world is clean. They sound absolutely positively 100% crazy. Like, how do you read that and go, oh, yes, these people are balanced, fine, great, love them. Can't wait to see what the mages are writing and leaving behind. Uh, honestly, I'm kind of surprised that these Templars are leaving. Hey, was it one of you that wrote all that stuff? I am kind of surprised that the Templars are bold enough to uh, just leave that all kind of laying around. Kind of thing, because like that sure is something. Can you stop? Please stop. Oh my goodness. Okay, good. <gasps> no! Too many, too many archers! I'm falling back! Okay. Do we have health potions with us? I think somebody brought them. I mean, was it my job to pack them? Maybe? Possibly. Make it take you! Good job. Any other creepy notes being left behind? No. Good. That's awesome. They said off the west road. Is this the west road? There are like literally no signs. <laughs> and I don't, no, I'm not from here. I have no idea where we are. If this is the west road uh, and that is the camp off the west road, then that might be the entanglement of crazy Templars. So do we go and handle that? Because wasn't, um, what was his name? Corporal Vale, was it? Wasn't he saying something about how it would be really helpful if we could handle the mages and the Templars, like the, you know, outlandish bunches of each of them. Anybody see any road signs? Did they also tear down all the road, road signs? Or does this area just not normally have them? How can you all not have road signs? Hi, I'm just going to assume. Probably going to get me in trouble. Always does. But my mom is not here to yell at me. So there's that. I know, I know, I know, I'm annoying. Trust me, I know. Okay. Oh goodness, very careful. You're squishy as far as, you know, you're archer, squishy. Not any other kind of squishy that I know of. Okay. Good. That couldn't be all of them, could it? That'd be far too easy. And this road keeps going. Um, yeah, no, definitely, definitely all up here. This should be fun. Oh, good. The it's Templars fortified. have secured the position ahead. Oh, yeah, they've really fortified this. 100% love that for them. <laughs> Hate that for us, though. Okay. Good. Well, at least one of them's gone already. Excellent. You. Hi. All of that. Love this. Good. Well, we made short work of them. There's got to be more, right? I see them. You see those three? Is it three? Four? Three. Hey, at least none of these guys got those annoying shields. This guy's gone. You. No. Wait, are you talking about me or Cassandra? I mean, neither one of us are really up for that, but rude. Also. Does he have to make that noise when he dies like that? Like that just seems so dramatic. Are they all are like our Templars just dramatic by nature? Colin didn't seem. Oh, you must be the big dude. Like, Colin didn't seem dramatic by, like, just normally, but maybe he's an anomaly among Templars? Or, I mean, he is an ex-Templar, right? Wait, is Colin still a Templar? Nobody's really answered that for me. I don't think so. <gasps> Good. Kill that warrior. Is he trying to kill us as we kill him? Impressive. The refugees should be safer on the King's Road now. We must still deal with the apostates, however. Which we will. Wait. Is that the King's Road or the West Road? 
Or is it the King's Road and then now this is the West Road? What are your road names? Does it even matter at this point? I don't know. I'm very confused. I can barely tell north from south half the time and, and now you're calling off road names. Oh boy.